my channel or welcome back to my channel. This is Everyday Plus Fashion. My name is Dawn. Do you got a sec? If you got a sec, just set that little red button down there. Give it a little click and subscribe. It would make my day. You know you want to make my day. So today's uh, haul is going to be, if you probably saw Torrid, but there's a little bit more to it in that I was, I have a, a wedding to go to and I'm here in Oregon right now, and um, I kind of plan to wear one of the city chic dresses, city chic dresses that I had bought before, but it's not gonna necessarily be like warm, and it's not necessarily gonna be sunny. I'm not sure yet, but right now it's been kind of drizzly and rainy, and so those were very like summery dresses. So I kind of panicked, and I thought, I'll just go to Torrid, Torrid will have something very much like the dark pattern with the floral. So a lot of these things are gonna look very similar. And you're gonna be like, what kind of haul is this? This is basically me trying to figure out if I can wear any of these things to the wedding. I will tell you, I went out of my comfort zone. I don't know comfort zone, I went out of my normal, uh, what would normally catch my eye. And I bought a dress and I'm waiting till the very end because I think it's the contender. I think it's the one but I'm not sure. So um, I have a couple other, like, that aren't from Torrid, and I'll pretty, basically have to have my daughter who gets in tomorrow from UCLA, have her tell me which one I should wear. So first and foremost is, or not foremost, I don't know why that's foremost, just first is this cute jumper. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna try to edit these out now, but we will see this adorable jumper that is, it's a wide leg, really nice fitted waist, but it's got some elastic smocking in the back. So it, it, it looks very close to your body, looks kind of tight, doesn't feel tight. Um, it is got, let's see, so you guys can see, we got purple and pink flowers. Uh, if you can see the waist a little bit, it's got pockets. It's got, it's very flowy legs. I mean, super comfortable. I like the arm length, covers my arms. Now I will tell you that I could not do the back. <laughs> so I don't know if you can see that. I, it's like one of those like little elastic loop things with the button and um, I couldn't do it. <laughs> I spent, you know, tomorrow when my arms are sore, I'm gonna go, oh, it's cause I was trying to put those, that stupid button on. So anyway, so this is super cute and I will tell you that one of the reasons that I wanted to do this, uh, maybe this would be a contender, is because of these absolutely adorable, amazing boots that um, are this like pink suede, this like kind of blush suede, and I just thought those would look spectacular with this outfit and kind of give me a little bit of the length because it's a little bit long, and of course I didn't put them on for you, but, uh, but so this is why this could be definitely a cute outfit. I think I'm gonna keep this even if I don't wear this to the wedding because I think this is a really cute piece and it's so comfortable and I still feel like it's kind of flattering. So um, there we go, let's go to look number two. Okay, I'm still in that outfit because I forgot to tell you that I got this in a size one and I was gonna tell you the price. So this goes for $78.90, but I guarantee you I didn't pay that. Um, I'm sure it was on sale. I think they just had like 30% off dresses or something, and that's kind of what prompted me to maybe go. Okay, this is the next dress, and this is a uh, maxi. You can see, goes all the way to the floor. It's a good length. It's got you know a little bit extra touching the floor, so any kind of shoes I wear is gonna make it come up just a tad. Um, it's got these. Uh, you know, these things I don't understand. These little <laughs> hold up your sleeve things. I don't know, I'm just never like really a fan of that look of that. So I will tell you, it's super sheer, super see-through overlay. Then it also has like a little cami dress underneath of it. The cami dress is pretty stretchy, but I don't know about you guys, I have the hardest time figuring out where my arms go in the thing. I almost wish it was separate and I could just put that on and then put the dress on because it's like connected at the shoulder. So it's like, okay, do I put my arm through there? And it's always like wonky and I feel like it's not even right now. So anyway, so this is another black with floral. These are a little more rose colored with some white and green. It's a little, um, a little less pink. So I couldn't wear my cute pink shoes, 
but I could wear my cute white booties, which those are the two shoes I'm bound and determined to wear one of these shoes to the wedding. And mostly because I don't have a pedicure. here. So, um, you know, I'm not as crazy about this. This again is a one. Oh, I don't see how much it costs. Oh, here we go. Seriously, why didn't I not come prepared? Dawn. This is, this is $74.90. So this is actually a tad bit cheaper than the jumpsuit, which I think is interesting. I just am not crazy about where it hits me right here. It's, this is just not usually a good look for me as an apple body because I need something that either hits my waist or at least looks like it hits my waist. And when it comes up here, you guys can see, I always feel like I look a little pregnant because my belly pooches out right there. So this is probably not gonna win. I probably will return this because I'm just not crazy about it and I don't wanna wear it. So there you go. Okay, continuing with the dark background floral vibe um, is this it's actually navy it's actually a navy dress which was kind of uh i don't usually buy navy and i kind of really like this um it's just a faux wrap dress um this part goes like here so it probably should be careful but i don't have big boobs so it doesn't it's not gonna go anywhere it's not doing anything um it's just a faux wrap dress real uh it's some you know midi length and as i said before i don't want a lot of midi dresses I, I feel sometimes feel frumpy in them. I think because I grew up where this was where every skirt hit you and it just looks like a, it just, it looks like a Sunday school dress to me. Like I should be going to church, but it is almost Easter Sunday. So maybe I can wear it for that. Um, I don't know if I will do this for the wedding, but I did think what's really nice about these shoes is that they're kind of a blush. So they kind of take on, oh, by the way, I got these shoes at Charlotte Russe. Oh, oh. R.I.P. Charlotte Russe, but um, I'm sure there's other, you can find other boots like this. So it kind of takes on like either pink or peach. This would be perfectly fine with this dress. Um, it's the, the tie is um, just a tie and you can put it wherever you want it, put it in the middle, put it in the side. I thought, so it looked more like it was actually a wrap dress. I did it right there. This is again in a size one. Everything I got is in a size one um, and it was free. Like, I don't know where the tag is. You know, someday I'm gonna look at this before I get on camera. But this is, oh, actually this is a two. I'm sorry. This is a two and this is $64.90. So $65, but I'm sure there's always sales. So, um, I mean, it's cute. I feel like it's kind of flattering. I mean, it's definitely, I just don't know if it's like extra enough for the wedding. I don't know, we will see. Did I describe these? I do have those cute earrings from Lane Bright. They'd be perfect with this. But um, anyway, it's kind of a peachy, peach and blues, um, and a little aqua. You know, it's cute. Okay, so for like a second, I was like, well, maybe I'll just wear a basic black dress. Because I guess you could do that at a wedding, right? But I feel like that's maybe more of a winter wedding. And it's an afternoon wedding. So I just feel like this might be a little too dark and depressing and kind of, but pretty cute little black dress i've been eyeballing this dress for a while because if you notice everything i get has sleeves that's a huge deal for me is it needs to have sleeves and so i do like this i was like where i was trying to find the tie and there is no tie it's just this kind of uh waistband but the waistband even though it's a little bit above my natural waist i feel like it's okay because it doesn't have a lot of extra fabric i don't feel like i look pregnant in this even though it's a little bit of an empire waist but not super bad. I like how low it goes, weirdly, because you still can't really see my bra. I could definitely wear like a plunge bra with this and maybe get my boobs to be a little perkier. And so you could kind of maybe see a little, a little bit of cleavage. I don't really have cleavage. My boobs are so far apart. But um, I just thought this was a great, like I would probably keep this dress just because, you know, we always need a little black dress, but also because I think that when I go on cruises and stuff, I'm always looking for something to wear. And this is super comfortable and would pack really well because it's kind of a stretchy jersey, I guess. I mean, it's really a polyester, let's be honest. But um, I don't know, I just thought it was really cute. Again, a mini length, and I'm not hating it, you know, because I don't mind my legs from like my knees down. So maybe this is something I should be wearing more often. Anyway, it's cute, I like it. Oh, size one, 64.90, I looked before.
Aren't you proud of me? Uh, so $64.90, 65 bucks again, it'll be on sale. Okay, before I show you this dress, this is, I'm gonna put you up a little bit. This is the one dress I was talking about that was kind of out of my comfort zone, just not something I normally would have chosen, but I saw it and it just caught my eye. I was like, that is a beautiful dress. It's just a beautiful dress. Not my style, but it's beautiful, and I kind of want to try it. And I showed it to my daughter, and she was like, oh, you need to try that. You need to get that. So I got it, and I have to tell you, it is, it might be one of the most beautiful dresses, like, that is so not my own style. Let's see if I get my boobs to stick up a little bit more. Nope. So, uh, so this is part of, let's put this down as a tab. It's called the Runway Collection, and I guess it was at, uh, when they did uh, Fashion Week or something. And it is, it's a maxi dress that goes all the way to the floor. I thought that my, the blush shoes will look amazing with this. I'll, I'll hold them up to it in a minute. But, um, so let's go over this dress. Okay, first of all, it is, it's, okay, so there's this, like, a design on it. Hopefully you guys can see. There's, like, this design. Maybe if I stand back a little bit. There's a little design in the fabric, like a floral kind of textured. It's like a kind of three-dimensional thing going on. Then there's this beautiful embroidery, which I don't usually like, because usually I'm like, oh, that looks like I bought it in Mexico. This, no. Beautiful. Now, I do like the fact that the arms are somewhat adjustable. I made mine really loose because I didn't quite like, I'm not crazy about the fact that there's this poking out, but I think I would be okay with it. Um, in, you know, just because I can't, when you're just looking straight on, you know, it's like if someone's going to judge that, whatever, I don't, there's nothing I do about that. Um, I, anyway, so then it has the embroidery goes all here on the side. It's very like subtle. And I think that's beautiful. The textured fabric goes all the way down and then becomes sheer. So it's like a lace, but it's like, okay, so maybe you guys can see this. Can you see that a little bit? make it see through. So this is the bottom. So it's like this material up at the top, but it's lined. Okay. So it's this like beautiful, um, gosh, I wish you could see the lights like going crazy, but anyway, so it's this beautiful kind of thing. And so this is like kind of three dimensional. It's got a little texture to it, but the top part is lined. Then when you get to about mid knee, I'm guessing about knee length, it becomes sheer and I just love the look of it now I'll say this is a 16 and it's it fits me okay here's the back of it so you guys can see the back it fits me it's a little bit I don't know it's not really tight it just I kind of noticed this right here because this is like a thick band and it's a little obviously like you know goes in right there so it feels a little, so I did get, go, I went ahead and I got the 16. So I'm going to sit in this. How bad is that? Just as for my own sake. So when I look at the video, I can see how bad this looks. But, um, so I, I went ahead and I got online quickly, bought the 18 in it. But the 18 is not quite as flattering. It just has so much extra fabric down here that I didn't really think that it had the same feel to it. You know, for me as an apple body, I mean, it, this gives me a waist and then like, you know, flares out, like kind of like makes me go like this a little bit. And I just love it. I just think this is beautiful. This is probably the contender. I will probably wear these. If you can see it's, I think it's good and good with that. Don't you think with those flowers? And I think this would be super cute. Just kind of peeking out under the bottom of the maxi dress. So that's my tar my torrid haul, my torrid haul, my torrid haul today. I um, was kind of short and sweet. Um, basically, if you're looking for anything floral, kind of spring, good transitions, winter, spring stuff. You know, when you're the weather's not quite as sunny every day. At least here in Oregon, it's not. So I still have like you know, still have some options for something to wear. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be this, but maybe what I'll do if I can figure out how to do it, I will show you a picture of me at the wedding. And I will let you know what it is I wore. Because I could end up wearing something completely different. You never know. Okay. Thanks, guys. Love you. Have a great day. Hit the subscribe button. That, that big red button down there. See it? See it right there? Hit it. Okay.
Thanks, guys. Love you.